You know, it's tempting to think that when you've been at something for a while, and maybe you've developed even a degree of familiarity or comfortability, you can begin to relax. It's tempting to think that eventually you won't even be tempted anymore, and that you can put your trust in the momentum you've built in your life as you follow Jesus. But you know, the individual whom God used to write more New Testament exhortation and encouragement, the Apostle Paul, he had this to say after following Jesus for over 30 years. He says this, I press on to reach the end of the race and receive the heavenly prize for which God through Christ Jesus is calling us. You see, maturity is not something you finally reach, but it's something you're constantly moving towards. Maturity isn't a goal to achieve, but a quality to balance in your life. It's a constant pursuit. See, what if I said, well, I've reached the state of optimal health. I'm at my goal weight. I, I got a haircut and I've even bathed. I'm good. I don't need to pursue health or hygiene anymore. Yikes, that, that doesn't work. Health is a constant pursuit. And so is maturity in following after Jesus. As believers, let's be biblical. Let's embrace a scriptural stance on maturity and growth. Every day, we've got to go after it in Jesus. Yesterday's gone. Tomorrow never really arrives because today, today is here and today is all we have. So press on in following Jesus for your spiritual maturity and health.